Once your API has been enabled, and you can see in your dashboard that you have the API here, you need to create an API key from credentials. And when you are in credentials, what you see here, for the moment, no API keys, but you just have to create here, create credentials, API key, and that's it. Very simple. But what you can do here is you can add a restriction on your key. What does it mean? In fact, to avoid bad surprises, especially with the cost of the service, you can lock the use of the API for just one IP address. It's possible. Also, when you have more than one API, you can specify the API for this key. But in my case, I don't want to have any restriction, so just cancel. And this is why you have here this icon. You can see that the API key is unrestricted. So it's just to warn me that there is no restriction, nothing else. So now we are ready to use the API and to return the GPS coordinates.